Like, what's the difference between a stratified sample and a cluster sample? They both sound like pretty like complex terms. Not too bad. A stratified sample is a sample where you divide all the members of the population into different groups. And then from each group you take some individuals from each group. And that would be your stratified sample. So it's gonna have different groups. And we're going to sample some from each group now. Sample some from each. And for the cluster sample, we're going to divide the population into groups again, but this time each group is going to be the same. So the variability in each group it will be exactly the same, same members. Like we can't do this a lot in real life. Because it's just hard to keep track of everything, all the elements in the population. But if we try our best to do it, if we just take the sample, uh, we take all the members from that group and use that as our sample, that'll be pretty darn close. It'd be just, it'd be like taking a random sample from the population. This is going to be groups that are the same. And we're going to take one or more. We're going to take one or more of these groups. As our sample. As our sample. All right, let's see an example. Say we want to find the most common type of tree in this town. I mean, we could go to every tree, record what type it is, but that wouldn't be too fun. That may be like really lame. So we could do a stratified sample. We could divide trees into different groups. How do you think we could divide all the trees in this town into different groups? I mean, they all, by height, each one of them has different height. So we put, if we put them into groups, say I'm gonna let this green group right here be the tall trees. And I'm gonna have, we're going to have this one right here be the middle size trees. So that be this little both ways era. And the gray group right here is going to be the small trees. For a stratified sample, we're going, to we're going to take a sample from each of these. So from each of the groups we made, we're going to take a sample from it. And whatever individuals make up the, all the samples that we took is going to be our stratified sample. So the stratified sample is going to consist of members from the tall group, the medium-sized group, and the short group. Now we could have more groups. We could like we can make it on the type of leaves, the type of roots, or whatever characteristics of the population we want to divide by. But still, we're going to we're going to have each we're going to have a sample from each group. That's that's a point of this one. And this will be this will be like a random sample. It'll consist of all of, of a sample of all members of the population, so no one's gonna be left out. Depending it depends on how many of these you have. If you have just two, it may not be as accurate. Now for the cluster sample, we're gonna divide all the trees into groups that are the same. So let's say we know we know that the north side of the town and the south side have the same variability in the trees. So we're going to say that they're the same. Let's just let's just say we know that they're the same type of trees in each side and they're about the same quantity and the same they're they're about the same. We could divide it into north, south, east, and west, and that would be better. But we're just going for the sake of this, we're just gonna do north and south. So for a cluster sample, I'm going to take either all this group or this group. Or both. Or if I had north, south, east, and west, I'd take one or more. I just have to make sure that each group is the same. So that this right here is going to be, is going to consist of only members from one of these clusters. In the clusters, each group that's the same is a cluster. 
each group that is different in the stratified sample is a strata. So I'm going to label that strata. And clusters. All right. Either of these would work for us, but just take from this that the difference between a stratified sample and a cluster sample is a stratified sample has different groups. We divide a population into different groups. We take some from each group as our stratified sample. And from a cluster sample, we divide the population into groups that are the same and take one or more of these groups as our sample. 